Hey, Angie, have you heard about that new pirate ship movie? Uh, which one? It's the one for the kids. Well, I don't know if you want your kids to see. You want to know why? Why? Because it's rated R. Oh, please. <laughs> oh, my. All right, let's be. I couldn't, I couldn't resist. We saw a pirate ship. <laughs> I had to get that in. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, good job. Uh, the designer is a former Loudoun County firefighter. He now lives just a few hours away in Virginia's northern neck. And only Fox 5's David Kaplan spoke with Daniel Quarter today about his passion. <laughs> It's an exercise in renewal, giving life to lifelessness. <laughs> Beware the Pirate's Cove in Northumberland County, Virginia. There's a retiree there having way too much fun. First and foremost, I hope I don't fall in. <laughs> Daniel Quarter's neighbor on the cove had a boat that was a pain a few years ago. The neighbor wanted to get rid of it. Quarter walked the plank and jumped into something he always wanted to do. I said, give it to me and I'll do something with it and I turned it into a pirate ship. Someone driving by saw the ship and bought it off him. And I said, well, I guess I got to build another pirate ship. It's morphed into, you know, this hobby of mine that's now, you know, produced 33 of these things. Yep. But I love the water. 33 sold. I love seeing people have fun. That number's growing too. For over 30 years as a Loudoun County firefighter, Quarter resuscitated others, saved homes, found meaning in saving lives. Now he finds that same meaning in saving boats, turning them into pirate ships and selling them for joy. The goal on this thing is, is honestly is, is not to profit. The goal is, is to take boats which were left for dead, um, you know, and, and resuscitate them into to things that are useful again. Some trinkets he buys, like skeletons. But you know, the, the problem that I have with them is, is that no matter how many I buy, I never have enough. <laughs> Other items he puts on the ship are picked up around town. Old columns from the porch of a home, unused planters, all part of a unique creation for a buyer he wants to sign off on. I'm building it for somebody else that's going to care for it. So I've maintained good relationships with the people that have bought them. And uh, I, you know, I, I'll kind of have an intuitive feel when the right guy or gal comes along. A project can take weeks or up to three months. And when he dives in, it's seven days a week, morning to night. A labor of love for those who buy them, but also a labor of love for himself. But uh, she's with me still. Cancer took Daniel Quarter's first mate, Denise, about five years ago. She was extremely supportive in this eccentric hobby of mine. Each build, each nonstop hour, something to keep him busy, something to help remember how much fun they had on their own pirate ship. Last thing she said to me was, I want you to be happy. I'm happy. That's what I do. In Virginia's northern neck, for photographer Aaron Kurtz, David Kaplan, Fox 5, D.C. Wow, what a way to find your passion while still, you know, having a connection to someone that you've missed and is now no longer with you. Yeah, and uh, what a tale he has to tell, right? You know, um, such a big story behind what he does and, and doing what he loves. And what gorgeous ships. He has a lot of talent, a very talented <laughs> I mean, individual there, which is why he's busy with so many people taking orders and doing a pirate ship.